This is Sandy Kalan. Having been involved with theater for many years as a stage manager, production manager, and director, I avoided children's theater. I thought it was silly, and quite honestly, I was afraid of children. Then I had one. It changed everything. My daughter opened a whole new world of entertainment for me. I continued in theater with the Prather Entertainment Group, eventually assuming the responsibility of the children's theater department for nearly 18 years with the Dutch Apple Dinner Theater in Lancaster, Pennsylvania. But instead of writing scripts for adults bringing children, I wrote for the child. Raggedy Ann was perfect for this newfound thought process. After all, she was the most beloved doll in the nursery. Johnny Gruel's books were simple and harmless. They allowed children to laugh at silliness and use their imaginations. When I looked for a script for a Raggedy Ann show, there was only one, Raggedy Ann and Andy and the Camel with the Wrinkled Knees. It had no music attached to it and it veered from the original storyline. I decided it would be best to reread the original book and write a script that would more accurately adhere to the intent of the book. My daughter was part of a specialized ballet training company at this time, and my orchestrator and arranger, Ken, was commissioned to write a ballet for the girls to perform as the American Girl Dolls. I continued reading Johnny Gruel's book and developing the script format, and when I got to the part of the story where it revealed that the pirates were really little girls, the construction of the musical was set. The little girls would be the dolls in the nursery, the crickets and the night animals in the deep, deep woods ballet, loonies in Looney Land, and of course, the pirates. The show opened in December of 1998 and was a delight. It was produced again two years later in a second theater owned by our company. So many other wonderful doors have since opened, and it's obvious that now is a good time to introduce the simplicity and lightheartedness of the Raggedy Ann and Andy stories to a new generation of young audiences. There's definitely a place for hype and special effects in theater, but there's also a vital need for simplicity and gracefulness and lightness. That is what this show is about.